Hey everybody, it's Matthew Rathman, and in this quick video, I'm talking to virtual instructors about this cool little thing called an HDMI ghost monitor and how it can help you when you're teaching virtually to save you some more space on your desktop and be able to present in the way that maybe you prefer to present. So let's just jump right in there. Okay, so let's talk about the problem we're trying to solve here. I have a fairly large screen here. It's um, it, it's great, it does the job. I don't really want extra screens and monitors all over the place in my office, but there are times when I am presenting that I want a little bit more real estate on that desk to maneuver things, look at notes and do other things. And so what happens in an additional um, virtual meeting for me is that I have my Apple notes up here with kind of an outline and links that I may wanna share or click on or go through. And then I'm gonna have whatever product I'm using. So this will work whether it's on um, uh, PowerPoint or Canva or uh, Keynote. But right now I'm gonna use Canva as an example. So I have uh, Zoom open and I am going to present and I really want maybe the instructor slide view or presenter view to come up so I can see upcoming slide and whatever notes I have there as opposed to uh, just the, the the shareable screen that the, that the learner is going to see. And so I'm going to go ahead and click on present here and notice yet another window pops up. So I have my window here again, whether it's PowerPoint or Keynote or in my case, Canva, I have that here. And um, then I've got this other screen. And so what I would normally do is go in to Zoom and I would share this screen. So I want to go share this with the learner. So I see the window they're seeing, but I also see it here in my speaker view. And then I've got, you know, I've got the notes I want to have here. And then maybe I got other notes elsewhere. And I got the chat window open down here. And I got the participants window open somewhere. And it just becomes a lot of cluttered stuff. Uh, and I don't really want all of this. So instead of having another physical monitor, I use this handy dandy little doggle uh, that I found on Amazon for about three bucks, three dollars and fifty cents for this little device. And then what happens is I'm going to click it in to the side of the computer. And when I do, uh, and I'm on a Mac, but it works the same way in Windows. When I do, it's actually going to pop up another window there and uh, show that there's another monitor on the screen. And so now I'm gonna go ahead and go back to my screen here, and I'm going to close these windows. And now what happens is when I go to click on present, and I click on presenter view and go back to present again, notice that no other window shows up just my speaker view on my computer. So now when I go into Zoom to share the slide that I want the students to see, it actually shows it as a new desktop and I can hit share. And now I preserve the real estate on my home screen here, my main screen. I don't have another physical screen here that's doing really nothing other than hosting those slides, which I get to see here on my screen. But what the learner sees is what I shared in another monitor. So three bucks, four bucks for them on Amazon. I thought this was a brilliant solution to make me be able to breathe better and have less clutter on my computer screen and a fake monitor for those slides to be presented on. I hope that works for you too.